We are the national unity, they are the illusion. We are the reality, they are the illusion. Facing the threat of a third civil war, Lebanese from all religious groups got together at the funeral of Christian industry minister Pierre Jamal, who was gunned down in Beirut on November 22nd. Most Lebanese blame Syria and Hezbollah for the killing. They also blame Syria for the killing of late Prime Minister Rafi Kariri in 2005. I just accuse bluntly the Syrian regime because he does not want Lebanon, the people of Lebanon, to be free. Independent. SLA General Antoine Lachat also accuses Syria, saying that the Syrians have a history of political assassinations in Lebanon. Depuis que Mme Blanche, jusqu'à maintenant, il y a une vingtaine de personnes, trente personnes, trente ans de juges de responsabilité. Why Pierre Jemail, the son of former President Amin Jemail? Why did the young Christian politician become the latest target? Il voulait faire une 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 bagarre entre chrétiens. On the contrary, Lachet says it backfired at the Syrians who are desperately trying to hold on to their influence in Lebanon. Now Christians, Muslims and Jews get together to try to protect their sovereignty and democracy. <laughs> the sons of Rafi Kariri and the brothers of Pierre Jemail are the majority in Lebanon. Il y avait plus qu'un million de personnes. Le million qui ont été raudés, qu'ils ont mis à la Mahkamé de Walayé, ou d'autres, Hezbollah, ou d'autres, Iran ou Syrie, et le Despite recent threats by Hezbollah to overthrow the government, the parliament convened on November 25th and voted in favor of an international investigation and trial of those responsible for assassinating Hariri. Hezbollah has resigned from the parliament and government, protesting such an investigation and trial. They are now unlikely to return. Many in Lebanon know there is a danger of a civil war, and there are those who are working hard to prevent it. Fait une guerre civile contre les Palestiniens dans le temps après c'était une guerre contre, entre chrétiens et, et musulmans. Non, 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 non. Tout le monde a perdu. S'ils font une guerre, tout le monde, ils vont perdre. Le Hezbollah, les Hamal, euh, les Sunnites, les chrétiens maronites, les chrétiens, on, ils ne sont pas comme on est, tout le monde va, va, va perdre. Le Liban va perdre. Many in Lebanon hope that this latest crisis will give them a chance to rebuild their country sovereign and democratic.